Hello, myself Sunil Sharma. I am senior engineer working with SES Instruments Private Limited, Rudki. Today, I will demonstrate the study of dielectric constant of solids and non-conducting liquids, model DSL01. The DSL01 consists of various parts. Digital capacitance meter. This is a compact microcontroller based capacitance meter. Its range to measure from 0 picofarad to 50 microfarad with auto range facility. A push button is used for zero setting. The accuracy of reading is better than 1% with 0.1 picofarad resolution. Probe arrangement for solids. It consists of two circular parallel plates arrangement of diameter 10 mm and 50 mm for smaller and bigger samples respectively. Probes arrangement for liquid. It consists of two polished brass cylinders closed the lower end with a nylon cap. This arrangement is mounted vertically and can move up and down smoothly. The outer surface of thin cylinder has vertical scale to measure the height of the liquid in the cylinder. Solid samples PZT Glass sheet Bakelite sheet and Teflon sheet Liquid samples Carbon tetrachloride CCL4 You can use other non-conducting liquids also user's manual and test results. Solid samples. Select the appropriate sample holder as per the sample size and connect the same to the capacitance meter. Now set a little space between both the plates of the sample holder without placing the sample. Next, switch on the capacitance meter and press the zero adjustment switch for two to three seconds for zero calibration. Now the capacitance meter is calibrated and setup is ready. Raise the upper plate of selected arrangement by unscrewing the same and place the sample. Then screw it clockwise till the plate firmly touches the sample surface. Now record the reading of the capacitance 487.49 picofarad. Similarly, we use the different samples glass, bakelite, and teflon. Now 83.19 picofarad for glass. fifty six point six five picofarad for bakelite thirty point four one picofarad for teflon. First we adjust the height of the coaxial cylinder arrangement so that it touches the surface of the beaker holder plate. Now the glass container is placed on the stand and filled with the experimental liquid of the container up to the three-fourth height. Next, the cylinder is lower down 
until the liquid touches the zero mark on the scale. Adjust the capacitance meter to zero at this position. The cylinder arrangement is then lowered down in one centimeter step up to the maximum and capacitance value recorded at each step. The observations of solid and liquid samples should be recorded like this. A graph of liquid samples reading should be drawn and its slope value calculated. We will use it in our calculations. In solids, applying the relevant formula in calculation, we get dialectic constant value of different samples. Similarly, for liquid samples, we get value of dialectic constant. After the calculation, we get dialectic constant for variety of samples. These values depend on different parameters such as composition, area and thickness. Thank you for watching this video. For details of our other products, please visit our website www.sasinstruments.com Thank you. Have a nice day.